it possible for a piriformis injection to give a false positive if the surrounding muscles and the posterior femoral cutaneous nerve become unintentionally bathed in the 10 cc's of lidocaine, so the local anesthetic that's being used? The answer is yes, absolutely. Especially when you're dealing with posterior pelvic pain, buttock pain, sciatica type pain, it's really important to be as specific and accurate with your blocks as possible. You don't want to use steroid because that can affect you know everything in the area. And when you're talking about a piriformis injection specifically, you definitely don't want it spilling onto the sciatic nerve or the posterior femoral cutaneous nerve because that can make things feel better and it's and it, and then you're kind of degrading the diagnostic value. You want that local medicine right into the piriformis muscle and nowhere else.